In this lecture, we're going to try graphing a cubic function. Remember that a cubic function is a type of nonlinear function. Here we have the standard equation of a cubic function. It is y equals a x to the third plus b x squared plus c x plus d, where a cannot be equal to zero. Below, we have an example graph of what a cubic function might look like. Here we have a cubic function, y equals x to the third minus two. We're going to create a table of x values, then plug them into the equation to get our y values. Then we'll have ordered pairs that we'll be able to graph. Let's start with negative two. Negative two to the third power minus two is equal to negative 10. So our first point is negative two, negative 10. We continue this until we have all five points. Our five points are negative two, negative 10, negative one, negative three, zero, negative two, one, negative one, and two, six. Now that we have our five ordered pairs, we can graph them and, ha and finally graph our cubic function. Here I plotted our five points on the graph and connected them as best I could. Now we have our completed graph of our cubic function.